Hi everyone, welcome. I'm Gav, co-founder of Tavira Labs. You all know me as OG Tevin from Discord. I'm making this video to do a step-by-step -step walkthrough of uh, what you can expect and do in Tavira Mainnet. Um, four quick things. You can access Mainnet on our website, tavira.com, which will be live on the ZK Sinkera network on April 24th, morning EST time zone, okay? Uh, let's get started with the walkthrough. As you know, Tavera is on a mission to unlock the next era of on-chain games, and we are very excited to begin the next chapter of our journey on ZK Sync era. You have two options to log in, Web2 and Web3. Both options allow you to access the game in two clicks without doing any transaction. This is to make sure you have the option to play and enjoy the game without any complicated onboarding. But in order to unlock the rewards and your on-chain reputation as a gamer, you must mint a Tevin ID, which is a one-time straightforward process. Currently, we support two wallets. Argent is still working on opening their access to ERA users. So we will use MetaMask to log in um, as part of this walkthrough. All you need to do is allow the wallet to switch to ZK Sync ERA mainnet network and just sign in. Next, you begin your three-step onboarding process. The first step is to get your Tevin ID. If you are an existing Tevin with 50 or more than 50 karma points, you will see a claim button like in this video. That will let you claim your Tevin ID and karma tokens in one transaction. Easy peasy. For new users or existing users with less than 50 karma points, you will see a mint button instead of the claim button here on the screen. Uh, you know, it, it, it just didn't make economical sense to us to sync the karma points for users less than 50 uh, karma points on chain. But don't worry, we will make your karma points available if you mint your Tevin ID. Also, there is a point zero 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 three ETH, uh, which is approximately 50 cents, one-time maintenance fee to mint or claim the Tevin ID. This is to avoid any farming activities and support on-chain features for your ID. Also, when you do the transaction on ZK Sync era, there will be a refund from the estimated fees you see on the screen. <coughs> the actual fees will be lower. Also, if you don't have ETH in ZK Sync era, we would recommend you to use Orbiter Finance or Layer Swap. They both provide different options to send ETH to era uh, from different networks and centralized exchanges at a very low cost. The next two steps are to mint a free Sphinx Guardian character and by transfer your karma points. Uh, you can do them here on the screen or on the next page. This is your dashboard page where all the magic happens. You can manage your karma tokens, access your NFTs, uh, rep score leaderboard, and play the Tevaran game from here. Since we have already minted the ID, we see a green check here on step one. You can also go in the hamburger menu here to look at your ID, tier, reputation score, and set a username for yourself. Uh, um, important thing is that this username is also going to show up inside the game and we won't allow any duplicate usernames. So make sure you mint your ID early to get the preferred username that you need. In future, changing usernames will be a paid on-chain feature. So make the most out of it while it's free. Let's start with minting the free Sphinx Guardian character. It's optional to do so because you will always have Sphinx as an in-game character. However, we would recommend you mint it to um, own the Guardian NFT for free, just pay the ga gas fees, and in future, we will allow you to customize your Sphinx character using shop accessories and upgrades as a user-generated NFT to trade it or use it in the game. The next step is to look at your Web3 Vault Karma Token balance. If you claimed Karma tokens with your Tevin ID, that balance should reflect here, like you can see it for uh, my transaction. If you don't have any karma tokens, you can buy up to a maximum of 2,500 karma tokens. The cap of 2,500 is to make sure the tokens are not being farmed. Whether you claim or buy karma tokens, please make sure that you are moving them to Game Vault, as we would be taking a snapshot in the future to make these tokens redeemable against a Teva token. Also, the game board karma tokens are used um, as a weighted score in the overall reputation score, and you can use the game wall tokens to play pool matches um, in Tevaran. 
Next, let's look at my NFT page. Uh, we already minted the free sphinx, so this is all good to go. The other premium NFTs that you were seeing as part of the testnet will be coming shortly in the next uh, few weeks, um, starting with uh, 10,000 Phoenix characters. And um, also uh, Teva Market will be launching soon so that you can trade these uh, characters there or use them in the game. Lastly, the most important thing, your reputation score, which is a weighted average of your Teva Run skills, Teva Run experience points, Karma Balance in Game Vault, and Guardian NFTs you hold. The rep score is the single most important factor for us to track your activities across the gaming system. This score also drives the seven tiers of your Tevan ID, bronze, silver, gold, diamond, platinum, OG, and Guardian being the highest. And these, uh, these tiers would also be your Discord role. Again, this is the most important score that we would look at for any future potential rewards. We are now ready to play Tevaran, which is available on Android for you to download and link to your account. Follow the simple steps on the pop-up screen to install the app. Uh, make sure unknown source installation is enabled in your phone. Uh, and then scan or copy the code from your mobile or web browser. This app would be coming on Google Play Store uh, soon as well. For now, that's it. You, can, you, can, you are all set to play. Um, and enjoy the full gaming experience, including reward from the from your uh, mobile phone. Please note that you can only play from one device at a time. If you are a web user like me, just click on the play on web button and enjoy the game on the big screen. We will do a separate walkthrough to cover the game features and gameplay. Hope you found this video useful. Let me let us know in the comments or uh, Discord if you have any other questions. Um, thank you for watching and thank you for your support. Uh, we hope you really enjoy the mainnet experience. Bye. Thank you.